Hi friends, it's Miss Karen. How are you? Today, we're going to do a little read aloud. And the name of the book is Train Your Dragon to Follow Rules. Well, we follow rules in our classroom. We have listening rules. We use our ears and eyes watching with our eyes. And we have calm body, give ourselves a hug. And then we use quiet voices. So let's, le let's read a little bit about this. Train your dragon to follow rules. I don't think he wants to follow any rules. This guy says, I'll read it and then I'll show you the picture. The rules say we must go to school five whole days a week. In our case, it's two. And when we're in the classroom, we must raise our hand to speak. And this guy is the dragon. He said, I told Diggory, everybody follows rules in school. Everywhere I go, he yelled, I run into a rule. And then this guy says, some rules will protect us and keep us safe from harm. If you obey them like you should, they work just like a charm. Like, look, before you cross the street. And never talk to strangers. Rules like that help us to avoid unnecessary dangers. Diggory scratched his head and said, I'd not thought of that before. I see now why we must have rules. All night, I will not fight them anymore. Rules keep us safe and help us to learn. I'm so proud of my pet dragon. Hooray for Diggory Doo. He learned that rules are good to have for kids and dragons too. Get your free gift from Diggory Do. Uh, oh, because he's learning all the rules, he got him a present. That's right. He was really happy with his dragon, who didn't want to follow the rules, but then he learned that it's really a good idea because rules keep us safe. And when you follow the rules in school, it keeps you safe. And you also get to learn by listening and looking at the teacher. That's right. Thanks for joining, friends. See you later. Bye-bye.